Nearly six decades after the last four-cylinder SL rolled off the production line in 1963, and Mercedes is reintroducing a four-banger in its flagship Roadster lineup in the form of the new 2023 Mercedes-AMG SL43. The new Mercedes-AMG SL43 may be the entry-level model in the Grand Tourers lineup, but that doesn't mean the SL43 is basic. While it has only half as many cylinders as its higher performance, V8 powered SL55 and SL63 siblings, this model has technology derived from Formula One that promises increased responsiveness from the turbocharged inline four. The technology, first shown off by Mercedes in 2020, is called electric turbocharging. Between the turbine wheel and the compressor wheel of the turbo, you'll find an ultra-thin electric motor mounted directly to the shaft, there to spin the compressor wheel in addition to the exhaust gases. Having the motor to spin up the turbo eliminates any lag and improves response significantly. It's real Formula One tech for the road. Mercedes says the system, assisted by the belt-driven 48-volt starter generator, can generate up to 14 additional horsepower for short periods of time, for when you absolutely have to make that last second pass. The company also claims a 0 to 62 time of 4.9 seconds and a top speed of 170 miles per hour. The SL43 turbocharger's 1.6-inch thick electric motor is tied into the shaft that drives the compressor wheel by the turbine wheel. The AMG E-Turbo can handle the heat from the exhaust, as it shares a coolant circuit with the 2.0-litre M139i4. Consider the electric motor and its associated electronics cooled. It can also handle the insane speed the turbocharger needs to make boost, as the little motor spins up to 170,000 rpm, while being juiced by the 48-volt system shared by the mild hybrid ISG belt-driven generator starter motor unit. The key points of the e-turbo is to allow the 2.0-litre engine to make power from idle to its red line with a minimum of turbo lag. It certainly makes good numbers, 381 horsepower and 354 pound-foot of torque. Those are well under the SL55's 469 horsepower and 516 pound-foot of torque but not bad for half the cylinder count. And check out the power curve of the engine. The 354 pound-foot torque peak starts at 3,250 RPM and lasts until 5,000 RPM, where it just begins to drop off. That's diesel-like torque performance out of a gasoline engine. GM's 2.0-litre turbo diesel LSQ i4 makes 281 pound-foot from 1,500 to 2,750 rpm. While it's not as low in the rev range, the 1,750 rpm peak torque band of the M139 is actually better than the 1,250 rpm range of the LSQ's peak twist. A few minor visual changes distinguish the SL43 from the 55 and 63. The tailpipes are round and the rear bumper is simplified, ditching the vents behind the rear wheels. The front bumper is also reshaped, and the SL43 rides on 19-inch wheels as standard, with optional 20 and 21-inch wheels. Thanks for watching and give your comments below.